No changes if nothing changes So I just keep rearranging Everything I thought was right is wrong What gives? My heart is sick and there's no trick Just gotta wait for this fever to kick But I'm no good at waiting You're a prima donna It's okay, I am too Said your name was Patty Okay, I am too. Said your name was Maddie. Maddie, I like the view. I got chills. Uh huh. Can't you feel it too? Those looks could damn. Uh huh, uh huh. But it's chill. Uh huh. We're just going crazy for the thrill. Uh huh. Madonna It's okay, I am too Welcome back to Live and Loud. Uh, my name's Mitchell, and I'm here with Cousin Simple. It was awesome to hear you guys play. Um, you played three songs. Um, they were all from your uh, Sugar Coat EP, if I'm correct. Um, do you, you mind are. telling us a little bit about um, how that project came to be and kind of um, your inspirations for um, some of the subject matter on the album or the EP? Yeah. Uh, so these songs kind of came from a bu bunch of different areas. Um, we wrote some when we were in Nashville. Some of these are ones that we've been working on um, for a while. Um, but yeah, these were all just ones that we've really been stewing on recently, and they all finally came to a head. I don't know if you want to talk about this a little bit as well. Yeah, I mean, they all just felt cohesive and felt like they could be on the same project together. And uh, some of them came together faster than others, but they all felt like... <laughs> They, sure. <laughs> yeah, they should be on the same project. So, yeah, glad it could be out in the world. Out of the three that you played today, um, I mean, is there a specific one that like holds a significant meaning to you in a way that like kind of made you feel like we have to play this, like, or j just in general, is there a song on the EP that you feel you need to show to people whenever you have a performance? Um, I mean, I think uh, Prima Donna has been the, the kind of standout track on the EP, and people seem to like that a lot. So, yeah, I mean, we, we like it too. So, yeah.
So you guys are from Columbus, correct? Yes. Um, I guess I kind of just wanted to ask um, how you guys formed. Um, are you all from that area, or um, did you meet through uh, different outlets? Uh, just kind of tell us a little bit about that. No, the same outlet, uh, actually. We, we, yeah, we all grew up in the same area. Pretty, or I guess the the the, the band here. Um, myself and Ryan went to school together uh, from first grade on. So um, we've been best buddies for a while. And then um, we met Mitch in seventh grade. He came to the, the school. That's where we all met and started playing music together. Um, and then Dave and Luke have just been kind of additions since uh, after the pandemic. They were like the best thing that came out of that for us. While we're on the subject of Columbus, uh, do you guys have any like um, recommendations for our fans out there um, in the Columbus scene? Like, What are you listening to in town? Oh, uh, that's a good question. Uh, honestly, uh, that we were listening to Villager on the way home, or on the way uh, in, actually, yesterday, and their new album is really awesome. Heck yeah. I that's... definitely shout that out, Villager. Um, I would say Spirit of the Bear, for sure. We record uh, with James Harker there, uh, and those guys are all our buddies. Do we just want to go down the line and pick one? I feel like there are so many. Yeah. We're going to do that. We're going to go down the for line sure. and just yeah, rapid fire these off. Sure. Uh... Yeah, Box Seats is my brother's band. Uh, they're pretty good. <laughs> um, I'd say The Orphan, The Poet. Uh, I've been listening to this girl, Mary Steele. Uh, she's like a country folk, um, just artist in town that's been, I've been enjoying. I really enjoy Dave's other band, Magnolia. Nice. I really like them. So, yeah. That's awesome. Um, love the variety there. Um, you mentioned Villager, and I kind of wanted to... Um, uh, segue into um, the next question um, as of today um, this is um, being filmed the day after um, Bloomfest which we are lucky enough to have Cousin Simple perform there as well um, do you kind of just want to tell us um, um, how you felt about performing um, on a college campus is that your first time doing it yeah the vibes were great yeah um, we, we have uh, played at a few colleges before um, but it was really cool getting to do uh, getting to perform and then getting to record with you guys too um, and you have a really cool campus I haven't spent too much time here ever before but it's really beautiful um, so yeah vibes were really good um, yeah and everybody that we've worked with has been like really cool and awesome and talented too so um, yeah we really appreciate having you guys um, perform not just yesterday but today as well um, so I kind of just want to go back a little bit to um, kind of the music you've been working on um, what would you say your like strongest influences are for uh, your sound? Yeah, I mean, we grew up listening to a lot of The Strokes, a lot of The Killers, Matchbox 20. Um, that's kind of what we grew up listening to. Um, but then, yeah, I mean, more recently, I think, uh, like The, the Wallows. Uh, or Wallows, yeah. sorry. They're my influence. I don't even know their <laughs> freaking name. Um, yeah, Wallows, I think, is probably one of mine. Bleachers. Do we just want to, can we rock, rapid fire again? Let's see how oh fast yeah, we can go, go with, the, yeah. with our influences, all right? It, Two Door Cinema Club. Glass Animals. Phoenix. Last Dinosaurs. Okay, nice. I can definitely hear a lot of that in your music, and you guys definitely um, have a really well-established sound. Um, Thank you. Yeah. Bed, long face, don't you know I've been missing you Shadows like a much shine
gonna leave you on one last question, and this was one suggested by uh, one of the crew members. Uh, so, if you guys were to break up, how mm. do you think it would happen? <laughs> yeah, I think alien. If aliens like abduct, abducted one word. of us, yeah. uh, that would probably be a. Yeah, that would be a reason for the band to break up. <laughs> I think the alien music would be way cooler than anything Earth has to offer. All right. Well, yep. <laughs> um, just wanted to thank you all again for um, coming on our show and uh, uh, stopping by BG. Um, we really appreciate having you all. And um, do you want to tell all the viewers where uh, we can find you all? Uh, yes, you can find us uh, on any social media at Cousin Simple. All one word, usually. Uh, are we different on anything else? No, just Cousin Simple. Like, your aunt's daughter and the opposite of complex. <laughs> and thank you all for watching um, another um, segment of Live and Loud. Um, you can find us at um, BG Falcon Media on YouTube and also on our socials at Falcon Media and at Mike BGSU. Thank you and you have a good one. Like and subscribe! We always take the love. Yeah.